The Marine Corps hymn, it's on my phone as a, and also uh, the Marine Corps emblem is on my phone. I'm proud. My name is David Castillo. I uh, currently work at the uh, San Gabriel Valley sector. My uh, job title is Assistant Manager of Vehicle Operations. I served in the United States Marine Corps from 1965 to 1969. I was in an artillery unit, uh, 105 howitzers. Um, it was a big change for me. I had um, never been outside the East LA, East LA area. All of a sudden found myself over in, in a country which I didn't even know anything about. It's Vietnam, jungles and everything. Um, it was, it's an experience that I will never ever forget and never ever regret. Had a lot of, I met a lot of good friends there and made a lot of good buddies and, and uh, lost some buddies. I want to wish my fellow veterans a happy Veterans Day. You've earned it. We all earned it. My name is uh, John McBrien and uh, I'm a division maintenance manager. I uh, manage uh, Division 9 in El Monte. I served uh, three years in the United States Marine Corps, 1968-1971. I spent 13 months in Vietnam. My job, I had a number of jobs in Vietnam. One of my jobs was uh, a pace truck. A pace truck is the first truck in a convoy. We would take supplies out of Da Nang to various places uh, in, uh, in Vietnam. I did a lot of driving, sandbags in underneath the floor of my truck. I had armor plating. Very proud of all those that have served, are serving now, uh, those that are living and those that have passed on. I feel very proud of being uh, an American service person. My name is Barbara Burns. I'm the manager of transit education programs, and our job is to teach the public how to be safe around buses and trains. Two memories stand out in my Navy career. In 1983, the worldwide tour of the battleship New Jersey. It was the first stop in Hawaii on a worldwide tour to introduce the battleships back into the fleet. The second was in 1990 the first Soviet ship visit to the United States since Glasnost. I served on the Command Information Bureau. And let's all remember all of the people who served on this Veterans Day. My name is Roger Dames. I'm a Deputy Executive Officer in the Construction Division and most recently serving as Project Manager for the Orange Line. I served in the Army for approximately three years, uh, 1968 to 1971. In the summer of 1969, when I was serving with the Army Corps of Engineers on a construction site in South Korea, uh, between Seoul and the demilitarized zone up in the mountains, we landed a man on the moon, and I felt very proud to be an American. I have a nephew who is serving in the Army as a bodyguard for the Commanding General of NATO and travels in and out of Iraq and Afghanistan, and I pray for his safe return along with that of all other military personnel serving overseas. My name is Salvador Llamas. I, I am a Division Maintenance Manager for LA Metro. I am uh, responsible for the maintenance of Division 15 uh, for the buses. and. Uh, I work in Sun Valley. Ten years in the United States Marine Corps where I deployed to uh, Operation Iraqi Freedom twice and uh, it was a very uh, life-changing experience for me. I learned uh, how to uh, build camaraderie and support and team efforts which would, helps us accomplish goals. Um, it also showed me how to appreciate the simple things in life. My name is Alvin Barber. I'm out of Division 5. I'm a bus driver. I joined the Navy in 1960. I was a ship fitter. I was working out. I, I was in Long Beach, California. And my best experience I'd ever experienced was going overseas for every six months to see what other parts of the world was like. And when you come back, this is the best country to live in because you see a lot of things that you don't see here. 
Hi, I'm Dieter Hemsing. I'm Director of Inventory Management for Metro. Uh, it's the job that basically is in charge of all the warehousing and distribution of parts, materials, and supplies for all of Metro. I spent four years in the uh, United States Air Force from 1971 to 1975 and uh, basically worked in uh, the special intelligence field working for the National Security Agency. This is the cap I wore most of the time when I went to work in Berlin uh, working for the uh, security service in the Air Force. Good morning, my name is Kim Hearn. I'm a maintenance worker at the Arthur Wiston Division 5. Title custodian, and I would like to say a few words about my son, uh, Lance Corporal Ryan Lee Mayhem. Well, my son uh, was a Marine. He passed in December 2106. I lost him in Iraq. Uh, and it's painful to continue to uh, live on without him in my life. Uh, I do the best I can. I take it one day at a time. Um, I miss him. I love him. And uh, he always be with me regardless of what. And I continue to live on because I have no choice. Even though I wish he were here. Veteran Day is next month on the 11th. Uh, it's a day that I would not be coming to work. I would actually be going down to see my son and spend time with him. And uh, I would like to thank everybody who was involved in, uh, and I appreciate the things they did and the consideration they had during uh, the time of my loss. And I just want everybody to enjoy that day and appreciate it and know what it stands for. Thank you.